The Villa Maria Southern Clays Pinot Noir 2010. This is a wine that sort of reminds us we, we really should uh, not ignore Marlborough as a legitimate and really good Pinot Noir producing region. Um, you know, with all the hype of, say, Central Otago and even some of the wines at uh, um, Martinborough and so forth, it is a region that we can tend to overlook, but we shouldn't. Uh, now, this one, um, uh, it's been made in a rather interesting way. It's, it's got a lot of macerated fruit and it's really been, I think, worked quite hard to, to extract plenty of flesh. And, you know, one of the, the criticisms of, of Marlborough can be that they can be a little bit lean and a bit, I think, light on for fruit definition, but this one really does deliver and it delivers it in, in spades. Um, it's a terrific wine, it's got good density of, uh, of fruit on the palate, but it does have that acidity, that line of acidity that runs the length of the palate, and it produces a, a really controlled wine of, of, of good finesse uh, and good power and good weight. Uh, so, in, in a classic uh, Pinot Noir style. So, uh, I think it's a very good wine. It shows uh, what Villa Maria can do, and they, they do source uh, fruit from a number of different regions in, in um, New Zealand, and I think this is one of their best. Uh, Villa Maria Southern Clays Pinot Noir 210. Thank you.